Hey guys, this is iMovie How To, showing you iMovie tutorials. Today, I'll be showing you an introduction to iMovie on the iPad. To get started, you need to press on the plus icon to make a new project. You can choose from making a new project or a new trailer. For now, we can make a new project. Later, I'll show you the trailers. When you make a new project, it will pop up to the screen. Starting at the left, there are three buttons where you can access the video button, photos, and music. So there are some, op so some features for inputting videos and photos. So first, if you type on a video, and you can press on this play like icon, this will let you preview the video clip. You press on the arrow, Right next to it, it will insert it into your project. You can also select these like circles at the either edge of the video clip, and you can trim what part of it will appear. So in my case, I will just press use the entire clip and press the arrow. You can use you can use two fingers to zoom out just by pinching it, and you can basically just play your project. button right here is the back project button. This is the help button. This is the undo button. You can hold and tap and that will allow you to redo as well. This is the settings, project settings button where you get you can do project themes, make it more customizable. Here you can sh show and hide waveforms, just like the desktop version of iMovie. So here's the microphone icon. This, this allows you to record things. And the video icon just allows you to video record things. So if I press on the microphone icon, I can record something. If you press record. This is a test recording. You can press um, review and that will allow you to preview the recording. If you like it, you can press accept. If you don't like it, you can press retake. So I'll take I'll press accept for now. And and our audio clip is in our project. So now what I can do to make it a little bit louder is I can zoom in by doing two fingers. I can double tap on it and I can raise the volume level. So next I can show you photos. You can go over to the photos tab, go to camera roll, and you can see a bunch of photos. So then you can tap on any photo and it'll insert it into your project right away. Unlike videos, photos just only require a tap to import. So here's a photo. It automatically adds a transition to it. So you have several options for transitions in general. You have none, which will just do a hard cut. We'll do cro there's cross dissolve. And then there's transition with your theme. So I'm, right now I'm using the modern theme, the default theme, and this is what the normal cross dissolve looks like. This is what the none looks like, and this is what the theme looks like. You can also add audio. You can get music from your built-in library, or you can also go to theme music, which includes royalty theme three. Theme music for, that fits to the themes. So I can just, just preview the song. Basically, you can just tap on it and it will add to your project. Yeah, so basically that's like a basic tour of iMovie on iOS for the iPad. Thank you for watching this iMovie on iOS tutorial. To see some more videos, click on the videos above. Subscribe to me as you're going to see future iMovie videos. If you'd like to see more iMovie on iOS tutorials, like this video. Future tutorials would include how to add text effects, credits, sound effects, and more. Thank you for watching this video.